Hey, I'm just enjoying the sight. It's free. It's free. The banter between the shoppers and the traders never stops. Sorry to interrupt, but if you are enjoying this video, would you consider hitting the subscribe button just below the video screen? It helps my ratings and uh, encourages me to make more of these videos. Thank you. Now let's get back to the video. It's not really the weather for dining al fresco. But the shoppers remain undeterred.
but eventually a reviving cup of tea is very welcome. Henry Fawcett. This was the chap I mentioned at the start of this video. His father William had been mayor of Salisbury the year before Henry was born, but that hardly qualifies him for such an impressive memorial statue and a monument in the cathedral. He left Salisbury to be educated at King's College School in Wimbledon before going on to Peterhouse College, Cambridge, which he left in favour of Trinity Hall, where he became a fellow and an influential economist. Despite losing his sight in a shooting accident, he later represented Brighton as an MP and was appointed Paymaster General by Gladstone. He was an active supporter of the suffragette movement and Charles Darwin. These achievements resulted in three statues of Henry being erected in various parts of London. But having left Salisbury for Wimbledon, Cambridge, London and Brighton, he died in Trumpington outside Cambridge, apparently never having returned to his place of birth. So, why the statue?